This is my this is my GF. This is Patty. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> you know what 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 it was what's the biggest question? Always you always want to know when every time you go to the gas station. I want a snack. What is the best candy bar that you could purchase in baby form? <laughs> Except for Kit Kat, which is you. We went to CVS to get candy bars because, you know, they, they have a little bit, you know, better of a selection than some places. And the, like, whole chocolate section had been cleared out pretty much. Aside from the, like, $9 bags of minis and the XL ones. So that's what we got. So we're going to be test and taste, test and... We didn't make it. We don't have a tier list. Oh my fucking god. Alright, we gotta find one real quick. <sighs> Finally! We're ready. First off, it's a Snickers. Whoa! This is like a classic bar. This is like your grandparents. This is my dad's favorite. <laughs> you don't need a meal, eat a Snickers. Okay. I'm not, I'm not the biggest Snickers fan. I put it at like. B or A, maybe. They're pretty, they're pretty good. I think they're pretty good. I think they suffer a lot being small versions. Yeah, I think so too. The peanuts are like kind of shitty. I think B. Yeah. That's where I would put it. That's fair. Ooh, B? I think it's right in the middle. I don't know. It's not offensive. Yeah, it's not bad. I just never, I just never prefer it over anything. Okay, next we got Kit Kat, which is huge. They didn't have the tiny Kit Kats. Gotta eat it this way, otherwise you're insane. And a danger to society. Yep. It's perfect. S tier, easily. Easily S tier. Kit Kat's like... That's a good shit. That's a good shit. Just wafer and chocolate is a really good combination. Yeah, and the chocolate is like, I think it's a much higher quality chocolate than what's in the Snickers. It's good. Boop. <coughs> Ass. These, as a young lad, Milky Ways were my favorite candy. Interesting. That's how I always thought. I was like, yeah, Milky Way is the best one. I never really paid much attention to Milky Ways. Like, I never sought out a Milky Way bar. My opinion has changed over the years. Is that <laughs> so? I think they're okay. I'm not the biggest, like, caramel person, though. B? Did you say yeah. yeah, that's fair. I would say B is one of you. I used to really like them. I don't know why. Milky Way dark. Caramel. I like caramel a lot, but it's not the best caramel. Yeah. It's okay caramel. It's not great. It's just, uh, just your average caramel. Milky Way Dark. We'll see how this changes things. I don't think it's going to change a lot. I think it will for me just because I really like dark chocolate, but... There it is. Midnight in the Willy Wonka font. Maybe I'm wrong. I think I don't think that's the Willy Wonka font. Perhaps I'm wrong. <laughs> I, I would put that... B tier as well, but like above the regular Milky Way. I think the dark chocolate. Above, doesn't... really? You like it less? I like it less. What the fuck? I like the dark chocolate. It's certainly very similar. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> there, there was very little difference between the two. Oh, we're moving on to the harder stuff. The harder stuff. The hard chocolates, <laughs> Mister. Good. I already know my opinion on these. I they like I didn't really go for them because <sighs> I don't really seek out things with nuts in them. But oh. um, my grandpa always had a candy bar of the mini, or like a a candy jar, so not a candy bar of the mini Hershey's bars. And sometimes it was only Mr. Good bars left, so I would just eat them because I wanted to eat something. It's an acquired taste. I like them. The peanuts in it are fucking nasty. They're bad peanuts. 
<laughs> it tastes so stale. Not really. Ugh. I don't think they taste stale. Ugh. Ugh. I've never seen someone have such a fucking negative reaction to a chocolate bar before. Compared compared to other other chocolates. That's nasty. I would put it like B tier, but you're gonna say C tier. I would least. put it I would put it D tier, personally. Jesus, that's harsh. I think comparatively, it I would belong in I think it's the worst C-tier. bar. I think it's the grossest bar out of all of these. I think you're fucking crazy. <laughs> Compromise with C tier, but the, I think that's the worst bar out of the whole bunch. It's gross. If the peanuts were, like, fresh or not, like, they just turn into dust in your mouth. Feels They feel like they're, like, ancient. It's the fancy one with the gold special duck. That's S tier. S tier? I mean, maybe I'm biased. I love dark chocolate, but I think it's really good. I like the aftertaste. The bitterness. Yeah. Just a little bit bitter. Not, like, super bitter. Makes me thirsty. I, I will say that. Yeah, it does. Makes me really thirsty. Where would you put it? I mean, I would put it in B tier. But if you would put it in S tier, then it would probably be A tier. A tier. Yeah. I am willing to compromise with you about Mr. Goodbar and move it down to D tier because I still have some of the peanuts like in the back of my mouth and they won't leave and it's pissing me off. There we go. Let's go. We got one. <laughs> Get out of here, Mr. Goodbar. Suck. It's crackle. Snack. That crackles back. Just like DC and Marvel have different versions of each superhero for each of their things. We got the crackle to the crunch. My answer for that is S tier and I'm not changing it. I will not compromise on that one. It's worse than crunch though. Yeah. I will crunch say that. Crunch has more crispies. It does. I never thought of that, but it does. I, I would put it I would put it in S. I'd put it underneath the Kit Kat, though. Yeah. I'll agree. That's good. It's a lot of chocolate. Sure is. Uh, okay. Hershey's milk chocolate. Just your standard baseline candy bar. It's just, just straight chocolate. Yeah, I'm already regretting this. <laughs> feels awful. <laughs> Shouldn't have been eating all of the whole ones. I love, I love, I love Hershey bars. Yeah, just just a regular Hershey bar is so fucking good. I think S tier. Yeah, I'll agree with that. I like it more than the dark one. Yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking about it now. It's a little smoother. Oh. Two more. I'm dying. Yeah, I feel kind of bad. <laughs> I don't think I want to eat anything for the rest of the night after this, actually. Like, <laughs> at all. <laughs> We're suffering here. Alright, Twix. Wait, which do you have left or right specifically? Left Twix. One time in middle school, oh. we went to the bowling alley for my gym class, and there was a vending machine there. And of course, all of us, you know, brought money to spend at the vending machine, get some snacks and stuff while we were there. And, uh... We only went there for like three days, but the first two days I got like a Twix bar and somebody who I didn't even talk to noticed that I got a Twix bar both days and saw me with one in my hand and was like, damn, you really like Twix, huh? And it's like, mm, I, I guess, like, <laughs> and like, I like he, him, he, I guess. he called me that, he called me Twix for like a week and it's like, Bruh. why, why are you paying that much attention to what I'm eating? Eyes on your own snacks. Jesus. Twix is very good. Yeah, the cookie in it is really good. I would put it in S tier, personally. <laughs> Another S? Well, we can... Or, or put your map for it. Okay. Three Musketeers. Uh, I, I already know how you feel about this one. Trash! Three Musketeers was my favorite candy bar as a kid. But I will say, compared to the others, like in this moment right now, now that I've eaten literally every other candy bar that we had 
it is one of the more boring ones. I still like it a lot. It's a little boring. Very plain. I put it at like D. I would not put it in D. I know you I would. I would. I would vote D. You're a hater. I, would, I I could go with a C though. I guess. Okay. C. Okay. It's plain. It's like a it's a Milky Way without the caramel. Yeah. The Do you want to take anything out of S tier? I would put Crackle down to A. Because, like, yeah. it is one of the better Hershey candy bars, but, like you said, Crunch is objectively better. Like, Just a better version of it. And I because think. of that, it loses a couple points in my mind. Yeah. So these, yeah, these are all, you know, this is just Fruit Pop. And then these are the two the two wafer ones. Yeah. <laughs> which make it just increase the, the, the flavor. Just adds a little something to it. I gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> you gotta keep them occupied. I have to. Yep. Oh my god. You better not be gone for long. I don't know what the fuck to do. How am I? How the fuck am I supposed to do that? Hold in. Oh my god. Well, I think we can all agree collectively that that was a terrible idea, and that uh, we're never going to be doing that shit again horrible i really didn't think i would that either of us would feel that bad after eating a few of these because like i don't know sometimes you buy you know the bags of the mini hershey bars and you just sit there and eat a fuckload of them and it feels like nothing you know you don't really feel that bad or you eat you know a lot more than that before you feel bad or at least i do but holy shit i am miserable and holden definitely is too <laughs> Oh my god. What a terrible idea that was. I didn't think that would be that bad. You see people, you know, on YouTube and Twitch all the time doing candy tier lists, and none of them seem as affected by it. What the fuck? Oh, that was terrible. Also, he better hurry the fuck up. I'm getting, like, nauseous. <laughs> oh, he was drinking also. I didn't even see that. Probably didn't help. He's back. Ah, that was too much goddamn chocolate. Hey, I'm suffering over here.